haven't seen your kitty kitty, you don't know what you're missing. <laughs> We're good. Are we recording? Yep. Okay. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> that's <laughs> that's the bit. Hey guys, Hello, what's up? Guys. What's up? Um, welcome to the 354 squad. We're a squad gang. Yeah, and right now we are going to be watching Tiger King, Season 1, Episode 3, The Secret. The Secret. The Secret. Hey. I'm so excited. I'm really hoping there are music videos. <laughs> That's all we're here for. That's all I'm here That's for. We're here for, the, we're here for the music videos. So yeah, we're really excited to watch. <laughs> it's going to be about Carol, because Carol killed her husband. I want to learn more about it. I want to see what's happening with Carol. Okay, before we jump in, if I, like, the amount of memes that I've seen so talk about fun. Carol killing her husband, like, dang, why y'all going after this lady like that? Like, she killed her husband. I'm hurt. I really want to see more info on what's happening at Doc Antle's place, because that seems like it's violating a lot of labor laws. There are a lot of human rights violations happening there. Yeah. yeah. We'll see what we find out in episode three, yeah. so stay tuned. All right, here we go. Season one, episode three. Let's do it. That's the first thing people think. Oh, come on. That can't be true. It's 20 years ago. Cold case 20 year old murders don't get solved. Until what now. Start? There's a lot of stories about Carol having some finger in it. She did it! I don't know. I don't know. Why, why is she always shot in slow motion? <laughs> Because she, she looked good. Because she's Carol. Because she's Carol. Because she's Carol. She's, Carol. 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 She's, Carol she's like floating every. I don't know if she asked them to do that. They she almost does. exclusively oh, film oh, her in slow motion. Unless she's engaged. I wouldn't be standing here today doing what I'm doing if it hadn't been for all of those things that have happened over the course of my life. She's had a rough time though, she, regardless of what happened or what she did. He indicated to me that he was going to tell Carol that he wanted a divorce. Oh. Never saw him again. Maybe this guy just went somewhere and didn't touch base. I understand why people live in Florida. It's beautiful. Uh, I would say within the first week or two, the What? What? He just went somewhere and didn't touch base. Hey, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just, out there. I'm just heading out. Guys, what if he did that and then just told all these people to so Carol get in trouble when he did? Sheesh. I met Don in January of 1981. So I was 21. I met him. Um, and he was how old? He was 22 years my senior. So he was 42. She! Yeah, was he was more than she twice your age. I think it was Nebraska. I don't understand these oh, men with these tigers and these young people. I actually had to throw a potato across the kitchen and into the dining room at him in order to get out the door. A potato? I deal with stress. I think the same way he has to do. I just paste the potato. A potato. And I a potato flew around my room. And he asked me if I would get in the car. And I felt he was on the third time. He pulled around and he had a gun sitting on the front seat of his car. Okay. And he said, you can hold this gun on me. I just need somebody to talk to. So I picked up the gun. He needs some help. Instead of spinning, then I look at this shot. <laughs> Don Rose deserted, basically. His wife and kids were just out there because he was in love with the younger blonde woman. Yeah, that's what happened. Yeah, that's what happened. He was in love with the younger blonde woman. Yeah, that's what happened. He was in love with the younger blonde woman. Yeah, that's what happened. He was in love with the younger blonde woman. Yeah, that's what happened. He was in love with the younger blonde woman. Yeah, that's what happened. He was in love with the younger blonde woman. Yeah, that's what happened. He was in love with the younger blonde woman. Yeah, that's what happened. He was in love with the younger blonde woman. Yeah, that's what happened. He was in love with the younger blonde woman. Yeah, that's what happened. He was in love with the younger blonde woman. Yeah, that's what happened. He was in love with the younger blonde woman. Yeah, that's what happened. He was in love with the younger blonde woman. Yeah, that's what happened. He was in love with the younger blonde woman. Yeah, that's what happened. He was in love with the younger blonde woman. Yeah, that's what happened. He was in love with who did that? That's a nice shot. After the angel thing. She was very ambitious. She wanted to go somewhere and be somebody and she didn't want to stay. She's so cute. The in the middle of the night. Cute. I've got her diary. I've, I've got it all. Happened to have walked in the mail today. Carol's diary. He said he wanted to be Who said the man he was inside. And that women knew how rich he was. But he carried a five hundred dollar bill around in his pocket, just because he could. In case no one knows what that looks like, because I was like, is that real? <laughs> Who is that? Even on the five hundred dollar bill? I've been for 
he liked to hide his stuff. Like he would hide money, bearing money. Oh, that's you know, like hide gold bars, bearing gold that's bars. That's crazy. To seven to seven and a half million dollars is what he was worth. I don't think anybody really knew that, but I'm, I know at least five million, if not ten million. His I attorney knew he was doing. He's Ron Swanson in it. He buried that. <laughs> I feel you. Oh, it's President William McKinley. I had been raped at knife point by three men that lived across the street from me when I was 14. Jesus. The following year, we bought 56 bobcats and lynx from a fur farm. The next year, 28 bobcats and lynx. The following year, 22 more bobcats and lynx. And by the time we did that, there were no more fur farms in the U.S. that were killing bobcats and lynx. They bought, sold, bred big cats for years. Oh, now, wow. I would like to remind you, Carol, that you are the one who spent $94,000 to buy animals to fill your so-called sanctuary. You still have them there to facility. You're still tagging them as rescues, and you're still frauding the public. Jeez. Yes, hair. Ooh, this Ooh guy. yes, we love it. How does it look? Dennis Hill. Joe came in with the facts. He was like, listen, yeah. Carol, I got the receipts. <laughs> oh, it's in a brain now. The VHS that she made back in the day, the last time I probably seen it was 1996. Look at that. You'll get a kick out of it, I'm sure. <laughs> you just had that? <laughs> <laughs> So I think one of their main problems was she couldn't be the only one in his life. That was your main problem. I think she think she would be the one to change him. Yeah. She thought she was pretty enough, young enough, that she would be all he needed. And that was never going to happen. For a man that has so many daughters. Did he have other women? <laughs> I suspected it. I never saw it in person, but I've heard enough to, book to say that that's probably true. Well, we'll yep. Sure. yep. <laughs> you didn't hear it from me. <laughs> <laughs> Don was 17 and I was 14 when we got married. What? My mom had to sign the papers and so did his mother because he was too young. The only thing that went wrong was when someone would call me and say, I seen Don with so and so. That was a problem with him because he did have a woman eye. He had given me a copy of the restraining order that he had filed for. Um, this is the second time Carol has gotten angry enough to threaten to kill me. It's enough with an F. Carol and I. He said to be sure and get the Costa Rica truck ready because he was leaving early, early, early in the morning for Miami. And that was the last thing that he said to me. The last My husband went to Costa Rica. Rica. He needed me to have Kenny get a truck ready because he was going early, 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 he said, the next day to Costa Rica. What? Is early in time? I'm starting to tell what? you something. He said, Kenny, if I can pull this off, it will be the slickest thing I ever did in my life. Well, what up? I never got to see him again after that. That was the last thing that Don Lewis ever said to me, was if I can pull this off, it will be the slickest thing I ever did in my life. Don Lewis said some really prophetic he stuff. Right some before before he down the Interesting. And I had to get all the titles to the cars and stuff ready. A full moon, but too? I need him to tell me something. Werewolf. <laughs> in a plane to take off. You wouldn't want nobody to know you was in the plane because that's now a clue. True. It was planted. Mm. At the van when it was at the airport and they let them bring that van back to DC Street. And it was there for a couple of days before the cops come to look at the van. They even look in the van. A couple of days that van sat there. What? Yeah, I'm like, you gotta look at fingerprints, you yeah, but... That's enough time to, like, wipe any... Yep, 100%. ...told that he was pushed out of the plane out of the door 50 feet over the Gulf way out. What? If he had any kind of an accident out of the Gulf, we never would have found anything.
fake tears. I joke. I don't know. I you just said that's some bull. Yeah. Forgetfulness or any of that crap. No, 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 no. He knew exactly what was going on. Where, who, what, where, when, why. He knew all that. That that's not a problem. She spent, I'm sure, a lot of time. Setting the stage for the dementia and, and the forgetfulness. According to diary entries allegedly written by Carol, she was feeling boxed in by Don's notorious cheating. It's no use to leave him. I wish there was some way out for me. Who can you I don't understand. And apparently they got their way. Look at his My understanding was that he was killed. Looks like a twister board. Oh. I need my clapper, Mark. What are you doing? Oh, this is Goldman? No, no, they hired the oh, actor. Oh. Nothing. 
Yeah, they got stuff. They just didn't get the stuff they wanted. Um, they get a fair settlement. She got most of the goods. You've got to look at it in the eyes of the law. I mean, I can sit here on this interview and tell you I kill 37 people a week. Well, that's okay. Don't say that. But you've got to have the bodies. <laughs> no, no. No. Oh. Your wife says the worst part of Oh, the no. Closure. This is wild. They haven't found anything. She's never got a funeral. Um, That's crazy. I had to say it probably 10%. Mm -hmm. You inherited only 10% of his estate. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. And where did the rest go? Zero. Dang. Bro. More slow mo. More slow mo. Relative to most. Look at her go. My number one goal in life is going to be to make this woman happy. Uh, dang. <laughs> oh my god. Look at that new King James. I want to be able to attend a funeral and with that being their driving motivation. There's nothing I'm going to say or do that's going to change that. I don't know, there's something sketchy though. Yeah, I something's off. We never felt that it was investigated well enough. There's absolutely no physical evidence at this point in time that would point at one particular individual. Wow. Nothing? That's when we got the thing from Carol to stop. I have the money, you do not, and if you continue talking, I will take everything away from you and your family. That's why we haven't spoken out. Dang. What a shot. What a shot. You <laughs> eyeliner on. It looks nice. her personal business but I saw like two cats in this episode yeah like, yeah yeah what does that do with the tigers <laughs> the tiger cam because it's there you know it's there it's like Joe's arch nemesis you know it's yes. his big big rival right there yeah so they they you know you always have to you know have a or a good story has a backstory on both the, the rival and the, yeah. and the and the and the key the key hero figure quote unquote key uh, key figure of the the documentary but dang I just don't know yeah I don't know if she yeah. did it or not, but I do feel bad for her because, the, and then this came out and then all over the place, like, freaking everybody's talking yeah. about how Carol killed her husband. Yeah, I oh, heard oh, yes. People were calling the sheriff's department with, like, claims yeah. and all that yeah. stuff with hot tips. Like, people were calling the sheriff's <laughs> department for, for hot it's tips like, I on this murder. I figured it out. Dang. From my couch. From Every, my couch. Everyone's playing After detective. After watching Netflix. Yeah. Everyone's, oh. everyone's playing detective now. I, like, I'm so interested to see what happens to that. Information is missing, so I'm like, please give us more. Oh, what Information is, is missing. Information and that's what it is, is too. That's, that's, that's part of Curl's problem, why, too. Like, why is she going Curl. To, Curl. <laughs> why was she going to Albertsons at 3 in the morning? <laughs> that... That's sketchy too. That's so sketchy. Like, why, why would and you? And then your brother that? happens to run it. No, mm -hmm. I don't like it. Oh. We're gonna watch um episode four real soon. Mm -hmm. Thank you all so much 
for watching us react to Tiger King episode 3. It's been real, it's been fun, it's been real fun. Sure. Like and subscribe. Do Ooh, yes, like and subscribe. Alright, everyone. Peace! Yay! Yay! Yay!